I'm going to talk about the cockpit now. I have a very long torso. The frame of my body is tall, my, sh my legs are short. I'm only about 5'9 tall, 5'9 and a half, but I only have a 28 and a half, 29 inch inseam. When I went to get into the Air Force, you're proud as can be, and they're going through the training and stuff, and they were measuring me, and they put me sit up in a seat, and they're measuring the top of my head. And this airman looked at me and winked. He said, slide down. And I said, what? He goes, slide down. So I slid down. He said, more, 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 more. And I kept sliding down. And the guy read the number off. And the other guy goes, my God, that guy's tall. He almost didn't get in. I didn't realize at the time how tall my torso was. I had troubles with some of the um, airplanes in the Air Force when, in training because I would climb in the cockpit, run the seat all the way down, the, and the rudder pedals all the way up to me. And the next guy getting in would get mad at me because he couldn't keep run his knees into his nose trying to get into the airplane. So the first time I climbed in a Quest Air Venture, I had the same problem. I put the seat in the normal position where everybody else is. I went to can close the canopy, and the canopy came down on my head, and it was I was too tall to sit in the airplane. So I did a lot of thinking about it. And if you take a look at the yoke here, there's a gray portion here. It's an anodized portion. And then the yoke portion. The yoke normally slides into there, and the yoke position would be right here. I added this piece right here to both sides and extended my yoke further aft. The throttle quadrant was on the firewall, throttle prop mixture, and there were push-pull tubes, which would be in the most smaller airplanes. I created and designed my own throttle quadrant and moved it further aft and moved my yoke back. I brought my seat forward and my seat back aft, and I sit in a more reclined position in the airplane to get the canopy down, and it's very comfortable for me now. Uh, the other person that's riding with me sits in his seat, which is designed like mine, and he goes, I think I need a pillow, and I carry a pillow along to help get them back up to the normal position. So again, it's an experimental airplane, you can do what you want for yourself.